So this edition is very exciting. We've had some great feedback from the first edition and this has allowed us to really expand it into some new areas. Um, we've managed to um, bring in a chapter solely on oncology calculations. So this is looking at really complex type of calculations for when managing patients who have cancer. Um, we also have got updated medication charts which are in use um, currently in Australia and New Zealand uh, and some of those are only just been, have only just been released so this is exciting that we will have a textbook available to students to start being able to use these, these medication charts um, before they actually get into clinical practice. In this book, Kate and I are very proud of the way that we've been able to integrate both a formula approach to dosage calculations, which is a traditional approach, but also give students a choice where they can actually use a very simple and easy method called proportions method to actually do their dosage calculations. So they can use a mixture of both or they can just choose one method, but it means they're not locked into this traditional approach, which can get very stressful for, for some students. We also are really proud of how visually appealing this book is. It's, um, it's a pleasure to open it and see lots of different pictures and to see lots of different photos. We are proud of the fact that we've got um, our, um, our national medication charts are in there so that they are clinically relevant. So it's very much about students opening up this book and seeing very similar things to what they will see in clinical practice. So when they are out working clinically, they will have a look at a medication chart and need to do calculations based on that, um, you know, comparing that to a medication label that they see um, in clinical. Um, our book allows them to do this. It gets them to start being able to interpret the medication chart and being able to interpret the medication label and then work out their calculations from that. So that is that I think is a real bonus for, for this book. This book has got so many features that appeal to students and academics. So the first of all is the real life examples. So the case studies are real. The medication charts we use are the, the national, nationally accredited ones with the actual medication label. So this is very real type of learning. Um, the other thing that we would probably show people is the way that we've integrated specialty areas. So specialty clinical areas such as midwifery, aged care, mental health, oncology and critical care. Um, we also have sections on ocular therapy as well. So very specific type of calculations that often aren't discussed in other textbooks of this type, but we've actually gone into them and looked at what are the specialised types of calculations that we would look at in midwifery versus that with you would see in critical care, which can have some quite different calculations as well. So I think the visual appeal of the book, um, but also the way that we bring these real life examples throughout, I think that really is, uh, is a highlight. Students will like this book, I think, in, in as far as it being quite visually appealing. Um, it has full colours, it is easy for them to see the medication labels as they would see in real life. It's spiral bound so they can, you know, they can use it anywhere. Um, I think students are going to like having a choice. All of a sudden they are no longer locked into this traditional method of formula method to do their dosage calculations. Um, so I think they're going to like to see that they can do a particular calculation in, in two different ways. Um, and we show them those, those ways throughout the entire book. I think with our book we have set ourselves apart to be very real and to have real case studies and to involve clinical specialty areas early. Uh, we are also comprehensive. We don't just cover just a few different types of calculations. We basically cover all of the dosage calculations that, um, that traditionally students would, would need to be, um, to be approaching. Um, our book is also full colour and allows students to see the medication charts for both Australia and New Zealand and the medication labels as they will in real practice. So we are quite different in as far as we have that visual appeal, but we also give a lot of different choices for them. 
think in um, medication administration and dosage calculations, the actual dosage calculations themselves may not have changed a great deal, but what has changed is the way that um, they are presented on a clinical level, and that is with the new medication charts that are available through Australia and New Zealand, which have become a streamlined um, medication chart, um, and also the medication labels. And I think we have lots of differences that are coming through with the way that um, infusions um, and how they are labelled. Um, there's a lot of changes that happen um, that have even happened in the last few months, and I guess in in approaching that with writing the new edition of this textbook we've really been we've been quite lucky that we've been able to um, bring all of those changes through and keep the students as up to date as we can with that. I think this book has got some really great appeal for students who are both visual learners in as far as we've said the the medication charts and labels but also in as far as um, pictures of syringes and of pictures of tablets and things that actually um, they can see and understand them on a visual level but also it appeals to students who are more text-based and it explains things and it, it, we have got um, lots of things that are set out uh, with text that explains why things are done a certain way. And also with this book we have updated the references so we are looking at the latest statistics and latest reports um, and we've used that to inform how we've how we've approached dosage calculations for students. So the book is as up to date as, um, as we can um, and hopefully should be a great resource for students and for academics to use in their teaching.